happy Fry Friday to everyone out there. Um, not really much to report on this week as far as updates. Um, I was talking on Michael's Fish Room uh, live stream chat last night and saying that I had a similar problem that he was having of having a difficult time um, telling the gender of the fry. Um, the biggest ones in here, like the one on the right side of the screen right now, and those larger ones right there, they're all appearing to be females, which is the problem that Michael is also having. Um, they are having a fan-shaped tail, um, not tail, but fin, and uh, it's looking like mostly females. I'm not seeing very many males, and they are right at... I think four weeks tomorrow, so I should be able to start telling their genders by, uh, I would think, next week. But some of them are already at a size where I should be able to start telling their gender, and I'm not really able to yet. But I know I'm being a little bit impatient, but I can usually tell their gender at about four to five weeks, which is a pretty common question. Um, and here's a little trivia question, can anybody spot anything new? in this tank. Um, take a very trained eye. You might have to compare it to my other video which will be up in this corner right here. I'll put last week's Fry Friday update and see if you can tell a difference. So what's the difference? Um, another update, I'm going to take my Celestial Pearl Danios to um, try to raise in an outdoor tub in my my driveway and see if they will do better with all the live food that's out there with pretty pretty a good amount of water coverage to keep them safe and keep the temperatures more regulated and more plants. Um, I have put the adult guppies back in this breeder cage over the weekend because I suspect that one of them is um, getting ready to drop fry. I think that one on the bottom of the screen right there is getting ready to drop fry. So just in case when I'm make sure that if I do have fry over the weekend that they, I find them outside of this breeder and not inside of the adults bellies. And literally nothing has changed in this tank. Still uh, male guppies from the free wild caught. And uh, one other note I have had the heater unplugged all week and it has stayed consistently at that temperature right there which means that the temperature is in my room so I guess this does not need to be heated at all. They seem to be doing really well. So be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, be sure to share. Uh, that would be great. I would love that. Uh, the 1000 subscriber giveaway is still going on going really well. Uh, share it on your social media with all your friends and family. it would be great. I'd really appreciate it. Oh, there is one new thing in this tank. There it is. Java moss. Really exciting. I better hurry and get it on film before it moves. Oh. So, uh, yeah, anyways, thank you for stopping by. Be sure to comment below any questions or comments you have, and be sure to comment below with what is different in the fry tank. There is a slight difference um, in there. Um, so, have a good weekend, and keep it fishy, people.